talking to oh, tight end Josiah Degara. Josiah, um, a lot of work. Yeah. You get a lot of action here this spring. Uh, what, what's it been like seeing your workload increase? It's been good, and I'm just so blessed to be out here with all my teammates and brothers. We've been working so hard ever since the new coaches have got here, starting with the very first week we got here in intensive training. and. Just to be able to be out here and tight ends getting a lot of a lot of love so far and we're just making the most of our, our opportunities so far. It's one thing to, to hear coaches come in and say, we're gonna use your position group a lot. What's it been like for you guys seeing just how much and how critical you're gonna be to this offense? Yeah, we we really obviously like it because we felt like like last year we didn't get used as much as we probably could have. And uh, you know, Cogs being a senior, I'm just uh, happy for him. All his hard work's paying off, and you know it's my turn to step up and make some plays too. So I'm just ready to do that. When uh, when Coach Denbrock was hired, did you start looking into his background, and how long did it take you to get to Notre Dame, and then mm -hmm. Kyle Rudolph and Tyler Eifert and the guys he put in the NFL? Yeah, yeah, that's definitely. Once all the uh, coaches were hired, we looked him up, and especially Denbrock having his history coaching a lot of positions, and especially tight end and the success that the guys he coached. Um, they're playing at the next level and the success they're having up there is just really, really cool. And we learn a lot from him as well as uh, our coach every day. So, How's Coach Phillips been? What's that adjustment been like getting, yeah. to, getting to know him and working yeah, with him? Yeah, he's, he's a great guy. He's been a, he's been a, he he's educates done everything. Us. He's done everything. He's done everything in his life from principal to D-line, D-line coach, head coach. So he's, he's very knowledgeable, definitely. And he knows a lot of, he knows everything, football inside and out. So it's just fun to learn from him every day. You're a uh, a lot more of a guy that's out running routes and and making plays, you know, down the field. How much have you been working on, you know, the inline stuff and and learning how to add that that part to your game? Yeah, you know, I've always been a, a kind of receiver, tight end. You know, coming out of high school, I was kind of listed as like a hybrid guy. So just being able to, ever since I've got here, I've worked on inline blocking because I know at some point I was going to have to step up and do that. So especially with uh, me running with the twos and uh, splitting some time with Cogs, just especially when he's uh, tired and we go 12 personnel and I have to block those big 280 pound guys. I'm, I'm just learning how to do that every day. I'm getting better at it. Things got a little chippy out there today. Is that uh, just yeah. guys you know, competing and yeah. getting after it? And yeah. yeah, there's a lot of emotion out there today. There's a lot of guys injured, so I think more guys taking more reps, they're more tired. And there's just a lot of energy out there. I mean, you can learn, look at it negatively and positively, positively. We, we, you know, we're playing with a lot of energy and emotion, which can be a good thing. You just got to know how to control it. Overall, what has it been like adjusting to the staff and and learning the way that they're teaching things and a new system and, and not just a new system, but kind of a entire new energy around the program? Yeah, it's just been amazing. I mean, ever since day one, the, I think a way to sum it up is just the culture has completely changed from we don't walk anywhere. We're always we're getting our weight checked every day. We got to get hydration checked every day. So just knowing and they're taking care of our bodies and the whole aspect of not just on the field, but off the field, you got to know what to do to maximize your potential. So I think that's what has changed the most. All right. Thanks a lot, man. Appreciate it. Appreciate it.